Hello everyone, welcome to the KCUI AS YouTube channel. My name is Stacey Angeline and today I'll be taking you through tomato farming at one of our centers in Quisero where we use hydroponics. I hope you enjoy and learn something. This process in it was soil sterilization whereby tuna, tuna chome mchanga in it pumic eh, after kuleta tuna mwaga hapo maji tuna refill your tank a half way alafu tunaweka moto inachoma steam alafu mchanga inaikwa hapa ambapo tuna steam inachoma mchanga kukua hizo any virus some of virus zote zenye kwa mchanga ukipata huku juu E, mchanga imeiva e, karatasi itakuja inainuka yenyewe una left for almost 2 hours ndio unakuja una, unatoa mchanga sasa tumefika mahali pa kutransport mchanga ile ambapo tumechoma sasa kwa greenhouse ikiwa tayari kwa kupanda nyanya ndani mtu yeyote haingii tu aruhusiwi tu kuingia ndani hapa step ya kwanza ukiingia hapa ndani tumeweka disinfectant water ambapo unakanyaka ndani kisha kanyaka ndani kuua viini vyenye viko kwa miguu unaosha mikono na jik ambapo ni tumeichanganya na maji kidogo unaweka kwa mikono rafu step ifuatavyo ni kwamba Unafaa kambuti kwa maana uwezi kutembea huko ndani na bare foot. Hii sasa ni mahali pa transport za kupanda sile nyanya. Hii ndio mchanga ambapo tayari tushaichoma. Na sasa iko tayari kwa nyanya hata unaweza vile nyanya zimeanza kukua ndani na tumechimba maji na ndio tunaitumia kama sasa strip irrigation ndio hii na unaweza angalia ndio hizi ambapo tunafungulia maji utakuta ya kwamba kuna nyanya changa na kuna nanya ambapo simekuwa kubwa for the tomato seedlings we acquired them from kefis which is a certified seedling supplier transported and brought to this particular greenhouse na baada ya siku tatu tukimwaka maji baada ya siku tatu tume apply mbolea inaitwa iskro starter ambapo ni ya kuboost mumea ili iweze kupata nguvu sa kuendelea baada ya 2 weeks inaweza kuwa imefika kama futi mbili baada ya 2 weeks utaweza ku apply black mamba ambapo ni 10 calcium 10 nitrogen 40 calcium na 10 phosphorus ambapo boost mizizi ikuwa haraka iweze kushikilia mchanga ikiwa changa namna hivi tunatumia watering can ili kila mumea ipate maji Hii nyanya ni type inaitwa Eva na ni nyanya ambapo inachukua muda wa miezi sita ndio iwe imeisha kufunwa. Kwa panji moja inatoka inatoa kama nyanya ngapi? Nyanya tano, sita, saba. Hii inaweza kunipa approximately kama kase mkatoka eh, shilingi 1150 hamsini kama matarajio yangu nyanya sikiwa mzuri mzuri kwa hivyo mimi nina encourage wa kulima msisoee tu kitu moja hawasi kitu hata kama ni gumu jaribu ili unayesabadilisha maisha yako na kitu kidogo kama hii
Mara mimi ni Milton Mtuli kutoka Kakamega County, Kisero Sub County, Kibinda Village. Na na nimeona hii process ya tomato iko na manufaa sana kwa sababu ukipanda hapo ndani ya greenhouse kutumia hii mchanga iko more profitable than kupanda nje kwa sababu inaonekana huko nje soil ya acidic na hapa ndani kuna venye tuna control pest hapa ndani kutumia hii mchanga ya pumic nyanya yote hapa hakuna hakuna nyanya nyenye imekaa kutan kuharibika zote ziko 100% hapo zilitoka zote kwa sababu ya mchanga vile tulichoma sasa unaweza encourage wanaweza panda nyanya iko marketable tena ni kitu inahitajika kwa soko sana uwezi uwezi vuna alafu ikae hapo kai japata wateja wakulima wenzangu nimependa hii nyanya inaitwa Eva ni kwa sababu hii ni nyanya ambapo ukikuro na utumie kondi ya sheria ambapo zinahitajika kwayo ni nyanya ambapo inakuweza kukulisha six months ukiwa unavuna kila wiki ukilisha sasa ile inakuwa mrefu unaifupisha inalala ni uh, futi moja kutoka chini silale kabisa chini kwenyewe kwa majina ni Robert Akalim Tuvi eh, ukulima huu ninafanya Kuisero sub county Ivinda village sasa mimi ni employee wa youth ni kwa ufupi ni KSY eh, ambapo imetusaidia kupata kazi Apart from encouraging the youths to get into agribusiness, KCYAA also provides mentorship where the senior members of the organization and the SACO tend to mentor the young ones who want to get into agriculture or who are already in agriculture as you can see from this video. Thank you so much for staying with us throughout the video. If you enjoyed, kindly leave a like and subscribe. It really helps the channel. And for more inquiries, kindly contact the number on the description box or leave a suggestion in the comment section. Until next time, it's goodbye.